Does Queen Elizabeth have a say in what Harry and Meghan name the baby? Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are thrilled to be expecting their first child together. And since the couple announced their pregnancy, royal family fans have been trying to figure out what the couple will choose to name their firstborn. However, the decision might not be entirely up to them. Royal names are more complicated than they seem. While most commoners have a first, middle, and last name, the royal family is anything but common. The names of royal family members can be long and complex, and many family members are named after royal family members who came before them. Prince Harry might go by Prince Harry, but his real name is Prince Henry Charles Albert David Mountbatten Windsor. It's a bit of a mouthful, so everyone is glad he just goes by Harry. Prince William is no different, his full name is Prince William Arthur Philip Louis Mountbatten Windsor. Thankfully, he lets friends and family call him Will. So when it comes to Harry and Meghan's future baby, it's safe to say it won't be anything too simple. Meghan and Harry have been considering several baby name options. It's impossible to tell exactly what Meghan and Harry will name their child, but experts and those close to the royal family have suggested certain names are higher up on the couple's list than others. According to experts, the couple might be leaning toward Arthur for a boy and Alice for a girl. When Will and Kate were expecting, people thought both of these names were in the running, especially Arthur, which is the middle name of Will and now Louis. Prince Philip's mother's name was Alice. Despite some names seeming more popular than others, the ads haven't always been right. According to Town & Country magazine, Lewis was far down on the list for a potential baby name. Queen Elizabeth does have a say in what the couple choose to name their baby. While Harry and Meghan will likely choose their baby's name, nothing is guaranteed because the Queen has a say, too. Believe it or not, Queen Elizabeth technically has custody over Meghan and Harry's future baby. And if she wants, she can ultimately name it whatever she'd like. While the Queen probably won't take that away from Meghan and Harry, she definitely does have a say in what they name their child. Both Harry and Meghan will probably want her seal of approval on whichever name they decide. Some believe the two might pay homage to Princess Diana. While the gender of the baby remains unknown, some believe that regardless, Meghan and Harry might incorporate Princess Diana into the baby's name. This is likely, especially because royal family members tend to have several middle names. Princess Diana's real name is Diana Frances Spencer, which provides a male, female, and gender-neutral name for a future baby. Whether Diana, Frances, or Spencer will be a first name is unknown and the couple may choose to forgo the names altogether. For now, the public will need to wait until Meghan's April due date to learn which combination of names the couple chose. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.